Rad Wagon 4. So this is the Rad Wagon 4 by Rad Power Bikes. We bought this bike. This is Andy's, Andy's Bike Shop's bike. Uh, We're going to use this for trail repair. We're going to mount a toolbox back there and uh, basically we'll be able to come into the trails and fix your bike for you. Now, we ordered this a while ago, it just showed up, but you probably see me riding it around. Uh, it is a neat cargo bike. Uh, it does about 20 miles per hour and it's a pretty good deal. It's like 1600 bucks you can get one. Now I know what you're gonna say. Andy, you should have got the Surly Big Easy. Trust me, I wanted the Surly Big Easy. But I could have bought three or four of these for the price of the Surly Big Easy. So, if it goes well, maybe we'll get one later. But I'm pretty happy with this. So we will use this to sag rides also. So we got a toolbox coming for the back and then a bag to carry a stand uh, and we can put parts and stuff in the toolbox. Basically, like this weekend there's a ride called the uh, Jackson Strong uh, Ride and Celebration that's on 1031. Uh, it starts at 930. If you want to go to the website, it's on Facebook. We shared it through our uh, Facebook Andy's Bike Shop. Uh, so you can go there, click the link and get registered for that. Uh, great cause. Proud to be a part of it, and uh, I hope they can get what they need. So, we will be riding this on that, and we'll basically just sweep the courses. It's a three mile course and an 8.4 mile course to make sure that no one's having any issues, and we'll probably go back and forth between those. But it's a great little bike. We're really looking forward to it. So, let's take a little more in depth look at this. Okay, so we've got cockpit up here, front light on this, and then we've got a 22 inch rim here. Uh, and then a 22 inch tire, obviously, 22 inch tube. Now, that is not standard in the bike industry, so you're gonna have to buy that from Rad if you get that, just know that. Uh, and I think that's the only tire option they have. I'd like to see a little more in the, of tire options, but I don't know that we'll really get that. Um, Mechanical disc brakes on it. We've got we've got the Tektro with the little grip here, which is nice. Uh, seven speed shifter, super basic. Just push this, click this. And that's how that's all that does. Really, I don't I don't use the shifter that much. I just leave it in the hardest gear and pedal it. Uh, I got a little bell. Add it on here with the same thing. This is your control module, so this is how we'll turn it on here. So you use this button over here to turn it on. So now it's on, and you can see you can go down to zero, so you can ride with no assist at all, but you should turn it on because it also gives you a speed readout. Uh, and it's just not, I, I don't think it's good for the motor to have it off and try to turn it so then then you can hit sit here click up so you're in one two three four and five so it doesn't give you like a mileage till uh and till till the battery's drained which i kind of don't like but it does give you this right here so that tells you just sitting here we're at about half of our battery life and then over here is the throttle So you can use the throttle all the time if you want. If the throt if you're down in one here, you can just hold the throttle and it'll give you 20 miles an hour basically. But the this assist is only for your pedaling. So when you start pedaling it changes it. Now I use the throttle to get started because it is a bigger bike. Like and if I had this thing super loaded down, it's nice to have that throttle on there. Uh, but I can see people just holding that and and 
just using that. They don't have to pedal at all. So, um, but when you turn the bike on, you also turn on the front light and this rear light. So there's nothing, it doesn't like flash or anything. It's just on and I'm not sure how bright it is. I haven't seen anybody else ride one at night. So let's check that out. But uh, battery here, you can see you, you got a tester here. So you can see, okay, I need, I need to charge it or something. Um, then you go into an inverter here or something, and then you come into the, uh, into the rear hub motor. So this is a 750 watt uh, motor. It'll do 20 miles an hour, which is plenty fast, especially if you're not used to going that fast, that's pretty fast. Um, it'll do that with the pedal assist and the throttle. So it'll give you, t it maxes you at 20. Uh, you got some nice little uh, bolt holes right here on this whole platform so you can mount a bunch of stuff. There's also that here and then also back here. So, seven speed drivetrain, a Sarah with a one by on it. That's all you really need. Comes with this nice big kickstand um, and then you can see the these are the the motor classifications. Uh, so it is legal to ride on a trail. Uh, comes with comes with fenders for sixteen hundred dollars. That's pretty good. Being that the Surly Big Easy is about five grand retail. Uh, all aluminum frame, not steel, uh, but. I mean, it's it's very well built. It's very strong. I don't feel unsafe. It doesn't feel like it flexes in corners or anything. Uh, now, granted, I don't have it loaded down really yet. Uh, we will though here soon. Uh, we got some stuff coming for it, and then two water bottle cages on here too. So you got a water bottle cage right here, and then you can put a water bottle cage right here if you want. Um, and you can put pegs here. These those are on both sides. This is, it's a good little bike. My only concern is that if you buy this, like you're not, your, your shop probably, your local shops aren't gonna have the stuff to fix this. You might have to call Rad. Super nice, great customer service. We've called them a couple times because we've worked on a few Rad power bikes uh, before owning one. Uh, and they've been nothing but helpful. They helped me through a lot of troubleshooting and everything, so. Uh, yeah, they're super easy to work with. Um, they, make, they make a great product and they have a bunch of good accessories that go on this too. Uh, I would highly recommend it. But yeah, so this is the limited edition black version. It comes in a orange and a, I don't remember the other color. I think, is it yellow? I don't know, I don't know all three colors. We, we got the black one because it said limited edition on it. Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't know that there's anything else really to talk about. It's, it's a good little bike. I'd highly recommend it. So if you'd like to subscribe to the channel uh, and like this video, that helps us out a lot. And then you can hit the little bell no uh, notification icon to get all of our updated videos. Uh, make sure you follow us also on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, shopandysbikes.com and uh, you can find us at Andy's Bike Shop on all the social media platforms. 10% uh, off if you use the code Riding Gravel at shopandysbikes.com. And uh, we just put up some new yoga mats and stuff. So we've got a new brand called Retrospec. Make sure you check that out. So we got stand up paddle boards, yoga mats, fitness equipment, uh, new kids' bikes, helmets, scooters, all that fun stuff. We'll see you guys later. Have a good day. Enjoy your weekend. And come see us at the Jackson Strong Ride in celebration. Downtown Cedar Falls. Peace.